Yeah. I don't know how many I have felt. Here, come here with your foot. Can they have your foot? <laughs> We're doing a comparison. <laughs> yeah. I've never felt that before. What? Look, go in there. Look, seriously, in there. Yeah, I did. There was a piece of yeah. everything, or whatever. Webbed feet. We have a duck. <laughs> we have a duck. Are you a duck? Are you? Are you? He's like... So, I'm thinking back to Great Dane puppies at 12 weeks old. They're about that size. Uh-huh. Eight, eight weeks old. Eight weeks old. Uh-huh. He's not well, small. I so I don't think there's any sign of what we have at all. Apart from the webbed feet. Well, that may have something to do with it. And the fact that the the, the, the vet's best guess was... No. <laughs> a Newfoundland. <sighs> well, we've got pawns. <laughs> well, yeah, well, that will... That'll... That'll be something to talk at the, the nursing homes. They can watch them grow. Yes, and swim. And swim. Anybody have a pond? I don't know. We'll find that out. So I'll tell you something else about Newfoundland. You've got to cut the hair off the ass so they get maggots. They get maggots. Thanks for that. <laughs> that sounds like we can hold. You can put the glasses on and snip. <laughs> right. <laughs> since, you're, since you're next. He has two testicles. The guy found them. Excellent. I suppose that's a good he thing. funny, that vet. Yes. She was hysterical. Did he like her puppy, though? Yeah. As long as he liked her puppy, we like him. Yeah, I wear the, the bill. That's one of the papers that you Oh, it's over at there. Me. I put it over there. Well, they are very clever. They, they, they fill you for a series of shots. Oh, right. He's got your newspaper. No, no, we're going to read it. Is, 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 am I in there? Yes, you're in there. I am what they do. I don't know. You must have done something, and I'm hoping, hoping it was good. Oh, it's going to help you find it. Hello, Wanda. I know. I love you, darling. I love you. Hello. Hello, Wanda. Aww. Special girl, you were special girl. Oh. Hello, 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 hello. Are you sure I'm in here? I'm sure Cloud said you were. Then I'm sure I am. So if Cloud said you were, you are. Wait, leave the blanket alone. So we may have a Newfoundland. That will be very exciting. I don't think. Well, there we go. Oh, crazy acres. Okay. Why did he keep putting us in under crazy acres? What? Hey, they're busy down there. Okay. I had trouble getting them off service one time, but. Well, I suppose at least that's one point. Oh, oh, there we go. Yeah. We're working on donkeys. Yes. Oh, I love that picture. Yeah, and then there's another. Is that the same article? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, stop eating those. Oh, that's good. I know, Dad. I know. He's a pain in the ass. Give me trouble. That's a funny picture. It is. I'll hold it up in a minute. This is how the donkeys behave when they arrive at Goldie's Farm. And finished product with Great Danes, both photos courtesy of Crazy Acres. Dr. Parrott arrived at Goldie's farm ready for a battle. He'd been called on three weeks earlier to give basic shot. I'll, I'll, I'll wait to read it to everybody. I'm paying attention. Oh, are we Are we on? Yes. <laughs> oh, did you want me to read this thing? Yes, I thought you'd started. Gosh. Well, I did start. Excellent, continue. I'm having troubles. <laughs> We're having trouble today. I don't, you don't understand, but at any rate, okay, well, here we go. I'll go out again. Dr. Parrott, DVN. Goldie Farm, ready for a battle. He'd been called on three weeks earlier to give the basic health exam to a bunch of donkeys just coming out of quarantine in Virginia. 
that had been rescued by the Equine Rescue Network, ERN. They had been found at an auction in Pennsylvania where they were destined to go by truck for the meat market in Mexico or by plane to cosmetic industry in China. Is that right? Yeah. By plane? Yeah, they fly them. They arrived at Goldie's where their opinion of the human race became obvious when we tried to sh shuffle them around different stalls or pastures. Now, Dr. Barrett had been called on to give out rabies vaccine to all the creatures that would be involved in going to nursing homes or daycare centers. And frankly, he felt we were all crazy. He had dealt with these animals three weeks earlier and did not have a very high opinion of donkeys at that point. However, it only took about five pounds of carrots sliced into carrot quarters and put in the frying pan to eliminate fingers from the equation. Add a bag of apple trees soaked in molasses and presto changeo. You have a very quiet, pleasant pet donkey, all ready to hop on the trailer and go to visit people in nursing homes or daycare centers. Isn't that nice? Mm -hmm. I've said often that the donkeys behave like dogs if you treat them that way. They come in mini, under 36 inches, standard 36 to 40, and mammoth over 40 inches at the withers, at the sh those are shoulders. Most are gray, but a few are spotted. If you watch the videos of donkeys in other countries, you'll often see them laden with all sorts of paraphernalia, just walking quietly behind their owners with no leash or halter. That would make them better behave than most dogs. It's my goal to be able to walk into a nursing home followed by a well-behaved little donkey. In my history, I had eight mini donkeys that would do exactly that. I was younger then, but apple treats have not changed. <laughs> And I expect to be able to accomplish this, especially if we can get a few other people into donkey walking at the farm, usually Sunday at about noon. Come join us around the pond. That's lovely. Is that lovely? Yes. I need to show those pictures. Huh? I need to show you the pictures. There you go. Boom, boom. Push and pull donkey, and then... Yeah. He's making a noise, isn't he? He is making a noise. Where did we get that dog from? Right, okay, I have mail today. Ah. Right, trash. We don't want an American Express. I can, tra I can trash the party. Trash. I think this is trash, but it's, it's addressed to Janine anyway. What? Um, don't you eat that. Um, that's another, our neighbor trash. Well, you know, maybe maybe we just, we just don't understand. No, it's trash. I don't think I don't think you always see things the way I do. No. Hey. There you go. <laughs> see, it's a toy. You didn't even know that was a toy. Are you picking that trash up? <laughs> yes. Excellent. That'll keep them going for about five minutes. Yeah. <laughs> then we'll get another one. <laughs> we'll get another one. <laughs> right. There's lots more where that came from. American National. See, look at him. He's very happy with that. Look at him. Oh, he's very he's happy. He's very proud of himself. All it took was an envelope. Junk mail. Oh, Open immediately. Brand new day at American National. Create your online account today. What am I... Uh-oh. Good girl, Wanda. Well, I don't understand. Oh, we leave it for Judy, because she'll double check it. You're looking for spare paper, aren't you? Okay, let's go. Oh my gosh. I think it just oh, it? Okay, look at that. In accordance with policy terms, the, the cancellation notice for a premium pay is fine. Is hereby rescinded. They took it back, right? Yeah. So is that it, means it's no longer a problem. Cancelled. Yeah. <laughs> well, why they couldn't say that, I don't know. I don't know. Oh. Yeah. Better give it to Judy. We give it to Judy. She likes these. That's for the generators. And I think Bud said something that we have to do something with a generator. That's true. But I can't quite remember what. Yeah, you, you, you asked Bentley. No. Yeah. But. Yes. He 
I knew you managed to give him the rough, the rough way bit. I'm going to get you a toy with a speaker. Give it to him and leave. Oh, God. I think we should just, just keep that and peruse that at our leisure. An hour and twelve. Well, when I just have to run through it. It requires to keep your honey well covered. They want us to do something. Do something. Most specifically, pay them $535. Oh, do they know? Jesus. Or flex pay 137 What the hell? They, they, they also think we only have one. So they're not really too up to date. Uh, I, uh, I'm paying them another $500. I'm so sorry. Oh, I can't see you up. Um, I do know that within the last six months, Thank you. I bought batteries for them. Oh! At $203 per battery. battery. Oh my gosh. For three of them. Okay. And I didn't deduct it. Okay. I forgot. It's just one of those things. Oh, excuse me. What the hell is this? Oh, this is Blue Cross Blue Shield. I think we like Blue Cross Blue Shield. God knows if I ever... I think they keep sending us confusing letters, personally. What? I think they keep sending us confusing letters, personally speaking. Um, notice for Carlene. That's you. That's me. Yep. I'm glad you De that one. Straight. Definitely. Explanation of benefit. I don't think we want to go through that Gosh, right now. No, I don't think. All I, I know is every time I turn around, I'm getting shot with something or whatever. Yeah, I don't think we've got the energy for that today. There I, you go. I don't. I don't. I got a problem here. If I can't even do a beginner Sanuko. Look what he can do with that. I know. That wonderful. He's a shredder. A shredder. Wonderful stuff. This is from Wendy. This is Wendy. That's, a, that's a good one, too. Yeah. I'm not sure that we've got that address. Oh, well. Look out. He's going to fix it for you. Here, you can have Here, that. He's this address. Oh, better not give him that. Here, Doris. Oh, wait a minute. There's, wait a minute. There's more to it than that. Oh. Here's more to it. Here's oh, more to that. Hold on. All right, okay. Dear Carlene, I just want to let you know that while a lot of people watch you for the mail chat, there are many more like me oh, that watch the recorded version later. Sometimes my husband will join me too. He affectionately calls it the farm Happy Acres. <laughs> I love that. We all look forward to the future when all the unpleasantness is behind us and we can have a big celebration. No. Maybe a Goldie's Warriors first annual picnic. Oh, that's a that good would idea. be nice. That's a good idea. Okay, Wendy, you're now in charge of it. <laughs> yeah, organize that, thank you. <laughs> Let me see. Wouldn't that be fun? Thanks to Elizabeth, Nick, Judy, Carly, Janine, Mary, and all the others who contribute to the farm and making... Chaos. <laughs> so, so many others so happy. Here's 20 bucks for hay. That's wonderful. Thank you, Wendy. Ah, but there's 40. Ready. Right. Well, and now we have to find out who she is because she can be in charge of the picnic. <laughs> That's probably why she didn't send her name. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put that in there. Uh, that would be fine. Yes. That would be very nice. Somebody's got to be in charge of it. You got yes. You start with making up shirts, like this yeah. shirt that I have on here. I told you to take that off this morning. I, you want me to take it off? No, not right now, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> that was this morning. You're too late. Too late. Oh, good Lord. Oh, right. Now, this is... So, thank you, Wendy. Oh, oh. What is this? This is the heaviest box ever, and this is from Betty. Okay, oh, well, my. don't drop it on the puppy. I'm trying not to drop it on anything, because it's got food in it. Oh, okay. At point you're like, forget the puppy. Look out. Bingo. 
Oh, it's a, a box, a polystyrene box. Hang on. Yeah, I'm going to drop this one back down. Because the puppy's not there, is it? You need to get a name because I keep calling it. Oh, my God. Right. Whoa. <laughs> huh? Nothing to see. <laughs> okay. Let me help you. <laughs> oh, thank you, Betty. Well, I would say just close it right back up. I will, but first off, ham. Wow. Yep. All right. Is it frozen? Look. Yes. Oh, my. Cheesy. Oh, gratin. gratin potatoes. She mm. takes good care of us. And, oh, look. Green, Green bean. bean casserole with onions on top. I, that, that's, I can eat them that way. I uh, had no doubt you could eat them that way. Well, I don't need very many green things. Well, you might so eat lima beans. Fried onions, I, and look, I know you'll not want this, but it's a lemon cream cake. Oh, oh. Thank you so very much. Now, you just have to get yourself in gear and get this cooked for everyone. For yeah. Friday. Excellent job done. When are we going to have this? Friday. Friday, Friday. And this Friday. is Wednesday. It is. Why are we having a Friday? Because it's Friday, not Easter. I know Friday doesn't, is... Friday doesn't come on Easter. Easter doesn't come on Friday. Isn't that a Sunday? Uh -huh. It's Easter and Sunday. Those two words go together. Easter and Friday don't go together. Good Friday. Good Friday. That's a different story. Well, maybe it has to be a Sunday. I... I I'm actually, I'm showing my ignorance here, I'm actually agnostic. <laughs> I shall ask the husband, because he is not. <laughs> I, would, I would go along with agnostic. It's Good Friday! Good Friday? Is that when you have a ham? I don't know. It is now. It is now. <laughs> uh, and uh, the puppy gets the box, obviously. Yes. Yeah, excellent. You keep those teeth going in there, mister. That would be very good. Thank you so very much. Rumor Betty. has it, all you people out there in Goldie Land, that this is a Newfoundland puppy. Yeah. That's going to be about as big as our Great Danes. We don't know. We well, have no way of knowing. Although a touch smellier. <laughs> they, well, they, they're hairier. Uh, yes, they are. The last Newfoundland I had, uh -huh. I shaved the front end. No, I shaved the back end. Well, listen, can we decide which end we're going to be shaving? Because it's going to be important. It is important. I shaved the whole back half the dog mm -hmm. and left it tucked at the tail. Mm -hmm. And the Linfield police had calls about a lion loose. <laughs> <laughs> There's a black lion up here on Chestnut Street. <laughs> and then, but let me tell you, you do have to shave the back end of a Newfoundland. They Listen, keep it at all decent at all. I will hold the head end for you, back him up to you, and you're good to go. You've got the glasses and the eyes. We're working. i got to find my clippers. <laughs> I own about 25 pair of clippers, you know. Oh, well, I saw clippers the other day. I think it might have been on Meredith, and I thought, I wonder whose these are, because they're not mine. I maybe, have clippers. Maybe they are. are you I eating it clippers, or spitting it out? and you're surgical it. clippers. And I don't know where any of them are. Well, this but let me tell you, if that's a new for them, we've got to find the clippers. <laughs> <laughs> it's it, 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 it awful little. Yeah, but there's nothing. A Labrador, you know, I mean, I know you get long-haired Labradors, but they're very rare. A Labrador is smooth-coated. A Blue Healer is normally smooth-coated, e even more like wiry-coated. Well, that's... Just because somebody said that's what he was, it's not a, you know, it basically means they haven't a clue. Yeah, exactly. He came out of a box in Pennsylvania. <laughs> this is a bit like Janine coming home with female goats. Right. Not to be trusted. She almost bought some home, some brown ones. What, on Monday? No, Elizabeth and I had to fight over whether it was going to be a brown yeah. or white. Right. I mean, I'm, I'm black and white. Well, we know you've got a color scheme. Yeah. And he's very... Where is he? Where is he? Oi! He's very sweet. He is sweet. Uh, he's bringing you more paper. Okay. Good boy! Well done. That's a jolly good job. Oh, there you are. Excellent. Excellent. He's already trained. Totally. 
and retrieval. Retrieval. He's a retriever. We got it. Retriever. Retriever. Yeah, he's a curly coated retriever. That's what we'll tell everyone. So think. sorted. So sorted. Is that a curly coat? No. That looks like a double fluffy He's coat. Sitting on one. You don't ever like it. No, look, let me see if I can get this down here without knocking absolutely everything for six. He's very busy and Wanda is not. Right, I'm going to try and bring this blinking thing back up. Girl, Wanda, Wanda has been very tolerant. Tolerant. Right. So you had a busy day. You went to the vet and then you actually went to a visit. Visit? Well, we did at home. Whatever, mm -hmm. whatever hell we, we went someplace. You remember to count the dogs in the car, out the car, yep. back in the car? Yeah, yep. did that. Excellent. Even better. And Carly went with me. She carried this one. Excellent. I did not have a walker with me, and it was painful. Was it? Oh. It, because this, this particular daycare has two... Oh, wings? Wings, and to go between them and get the dog straight, and this carried... And, yeah, that's you know. a lot. And they got to punch your way in and punch your way out. you got to wait for somebody to come along that... You know, he's only oh, got his head under now. <coughs> he's doing a good job. He's doing a very good job. He's finding things. You know, I had a I had a bird. Uh huh. One of those white that goes. Aah! You know the, that one. Uh -huh. you know, put the thing in there. I I I lived in my drawer. He liked he liked to live in the drawer, so I put him in there and shut the drawer mm. and put paper in with him. And within a very short time, everything was three quarters of an inch inside. The uniformity of his tearing those papers was amazing. He tore everything. It, he just shredded it to just the right. It must have been the size of his beak, or yeah. I don't know. Well, I used to have my grandfather bred me a budgie for when I was born, because doesn't every newborn need a budgie? No. No. And. Um, and he used to, he, he lived, he did actually live in a cage and um, he used to shred the wallpaper on the wall and he was called Naughty Peter and he's, um, and he remains known as Naughty Peter. So yeah, I, I like, I like the name Peter. Yeah, but not with Naughty before it. Well, we've got to name him something. Uh, he's not, hey, uh, you, that's your uh, oxygen tube or it was? Not now. <laughs> oh yeah, there's another wee bit in the floor. That was a siphon hose. It is a siphon hose. Let's hope we're not needing that. Good job. Oh dear. Oh dear. So yes. And so I had a, a lovely lady and gentleman come and see one of the donkeys on Meredith today. So we spent a long time having a look at them. And um, it's one of the donkeys that we wouldn't be using as our. Um, as part of our therapy team and so that was very interesting and she worked with them very nicely and then I had another lady come to see another horse this afternoon and then I did evening chores and I came back here to play with your puppy. You have got very sharp little teeth. I want to do something about that. So it has been a busy busy day and I did take uh, Wilbur out, you know the little pony that's down there, he is Fluffy McFlufferson. I started taking the uh, shedding rake over him and I stopped and I thought, no, I need him dry to do this. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yeah, that's enough of that nonsense. Here, we'll just think. Um, it was, uh, yep, so he's a, uh, well, I think we'll get a good idea of what spots we've got on him and what he's going to look like and how much work he's needing weight wise uh, once we get some of that hair off. So, but he walked perfectly. His feet are just in such bad condition. Um, they're really, oh, the hooves are mm, horrible. Yeah. But he's walking quite comfortably, which is super. And the tendons at the back of his legs that we were uh, very concerned about seem to be holding up fine. So that's good. So just lots of restorative footwork. Right. Which is nice. Yeah. And I am going to go, oh, and have a looky-see here. Oh. But he said that was a good article. You think article. you're going to hold him with one hand, don't you? I've got him actually sort of wedged under here as well. Name him Newton. But Newton? Newton. Newton? Yep. Newton. Newton. Isaac Newton. Yep. Fig? Fig. Fig Newton. We can't name everything after after food. <laughs> Fanning food. Yeah. Newton's cute. I like Peter. You like Peter? I had a horse.
horse named Peter. Yes, the dog. Did you have a horse called Peter? Peter had a great big Roman nose. Oh, huge. Oh. Three gated horse. Well, fine, actually. We can't call him Finnegan because that's uh, Carly's horse's name. Oh. Um, Wanda is in the house. Wanda's right here. Hi, Wanda. I know. Oh, there we go. I'm so. Um, so. The funny thing about this dog is we are feeding him in his crate, and he now likes his crate. He does. He asked to get in there. Yes, I saw these people that said it was a Landseer Newfoundland, so that's super. So that might be what we've got, but we're not holding our breath at the moment. Goodness only knows. Dr. Paul had a Newfoundland. Yeah. There you go. This oh. is a little bit... The Landseer Newfoundland, I believe, is just the, 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 the neck. We have a little bit more here. <laughs> I, I don't know if Landseers go all the way back with the, with the white. But. No. They made with the tail. See, yeah, the, the, it's a the, very white tail. The Great Danes all have a white tip on their tail, and so does this. Yeah, it's got a very. Or big... so does Wanda too, but that whole thing doesn't matter. Hello, Wanda. You're a good girl. Yeah, I think he's going to be super. He's going to be super fun anyway. The big dogs are outside. It wasn't very nice weather this morning. It was a bit drizzly and dank, wasn't it? It, it was. A bit and I was promised dry weather. I was a bit disappointed. I, I, I kind of like dank, though. Yeah, not when you're oh, working with do. animals and trying to get the hair out of them. No. Mind you, I suppose it wasn't airborne hair, which was nice. Don't chew that. No. So, um, so this afternoon it, it's it's much drier. So they're out having a bit of fresh air. I'll sort them. They don't think they're having having fresh air. They're standing at the door. You're having fresh air, you little stinkers. <laughs> Enjoy it. It'll probably be raining tomorrow. Uh, it'll probably be raining tomorrow. Oh. So, yes. Rain. Yeah, but you haven't been down to see the paddocks. The paddocks are sort of like muddy and yucky and absolutely awful. So. I know. I know, but it was fun while I was coming down. Well, that's quite funny. This this lady's friend, um, she had um, Lance, a, a Lanceer. Her friend bred puppies, and one was a Lanceer, Newfoundland, and they called it Moo. Moo? Like a cow print. Look. Moo? Black and white, like the cows. Yeah. Obviously, well, it's not cow. going to be a Moo then. I don't know where she gets this thing. <laughs> I'm reading it. I don't even have my glasses on says she didn't finish her sudoku honestly no oh, that's terrible i will give wanda cuddles later on she's lying on the heated blanket at the moment and she's quite calm the puppy is on the floor because that's the safest place for him wanda's brother i don't think wanda wants this puppy as her brother at all <laughs> fact i think so in fact, she's trying to disown him. Too sweet. It's Good Friday. It is Friday we're having that. Friday is Good Friday, Easter Sunday. And, and Good Friday, Easter Sunday. Oh, that's now confused me even more. Uh, Good Friday. We just need to know when we eat Easter dinner. That's, that's the only question we need answered here. Oh, no, Good Friday is fish. That could be. Right, okay. We celebrate Easter on Sunday. Right, okay. That's us. We've established that. We can, we can, eat, we can establish <laughs> eating food anytime. Yeah. Is that frozen? It is frozen. It is frozen. We're going to keep it frozen, hopefully. We're going to put it in the freezer. Is that right? Yes, we will until the day before. The day before. Um, we're going to have our Easter. Um, Fugan, yes, we did read it. And I actually found that very interesting last night. So thank you so very much. Yeah, he has got quite a quite a long snout for you. And he may need a furminator. Although sometimes the furminators, when you've got such a thick coat, you know the ones that have got the hooks on them? They can really pull. 
you know the Furminator uh, brushes? They're like combs, but they're bent. Those things, yeah. yeah. Yeah, sometimes they really are... They pull hair out. Yeah, but sometimes I feel they're a bit sore. <laughs> sometimes that's not the, the greatest. Yeah, so... It's we'll, very soft hair. It is, yeah. Oh. And I have not seen any fleas. No. With, with, I've been scratching like hell, but I haven't seen it. No. I have not. <laughs> the scratching I have has nothing to do with it. <laughs> they did think so a long time ago. Yeah. And I've been treated forever. Yeah. Yet. So you didn't give the puppy fleas. That's all we need to know. <laughs> so, so the other thing is that um, uh, Wanda this morning, just before you left for the vet, remember her watching Wanda and she started going, flo, flo, flo. Yeah. we were like, oh, it's fleas. He's brought in fleas. But he seems fine. Yeah. Well, the vet gave me, mm -hmm. actually I never read the box, but I, what I think it is, is I think it's heartworm stuff that treats fleas. All right, okay, that's fine. Because I do know there is such a product. Right, yes. We don't usually use it, A, because it's expensive, and B, we treat for the heartworm. Yeah. And the fleas are not the problem. Yes, this is true. Yep. I shall lift the puppy up again. Look, there's been a request, sunshine. Come on, we love. Look, he's got a wee spotty tummy. He's lovely. A wee spotty tummy. Now, just settle. Settle nicely. He's had his toenail done. Oh. And he behaved very nicely, I was did told. Did he do that at the vet? The vet did it. That was $14. <laughs> oh, dear. I need, a, I need a copy of my book. Because he was so serious about giving me directions on how to housebreak a puppy. I also have said in my lifetime that I have never housebroken anything. I really don't know how to do it. They pick it up as you're going along, don't they? You take them outside quick. When they get, when they, you know, if they had a long nap and they filled up their bladder, you pick them up, run from the door, and that's how you housebreak a puppy. Mm -hmm. This then one, this one is not housebroken yet. But she's a very special dog. I know. She shits right in front of the toilet sometimes. <clears throat> yes, she does. That's because she knows where, where she should go. Well, we just flush it. Right? Yeah, she can't quite get, she's got short legs, she uh, can't quite get up there. Oh. Uh, no, Larky and Sizzle are having outdoor time. That much. We've got big bolts of food here as well. They, they're fine with them though. Yeah, they are fine. Oh, right. Are you going back you down again? Down. I know he's, sure. Before he, you drop he's reversing. Right. Don't annoy Wanda, though, whatever you do. Oh. Newton is a nice name for him. What? Newton. Newton? Newt. Newton? Newt. Pasta, Peter. People think you like things with P in them. Pasta. I like it names that sound distinctive because when I'm trying to train them, I feel like pasta. You know, well, sure. apparently Fugan says she likes Zorro because Janine named him and he has a mask and a black pretty mask. See, Zorro doesn't have a snap to it. No. Pasta. Louis. Louis? Louis's nice. Elena likes Peter. <laughs> Carly and Mike are surviving. You get the movies. Is this a song? Is this syphilis or something strange? I don't know anything about that. <laughs> Bernie. Bernie. Bernie's bound dog. Yep. He hasn't gone up to the fire, has he? And Hilda says you should call him Spirit, Goldie's Spirit of the left hand drawer. Spirit? Janine's unfortunately not very well today, um, so we put her in quarantine, and uh, we'll not be speaking to her until she can <laughs> until she can prove that she is. She got me into the vet office uh -huh. on a chair with this on my lap. Yeah. And ran for the door. Yes. So she's unwell. And ran for the dumpster. Yes. And a few other places. Yes. So we will not be communing with her until she's feeling better. Best wishes, Janine, though. When Janine is unwell, she, her entire being is unwell. Well, she's very rarely unwell, though. She's very rarely unwell, but, but 
if she completely crumps. Yes. And I think that's probably what's happened. I think she's been physically working terribly hard down there. And then she drove and off. I think, I, think, <laughs> I think she saved it all up, and now she can't get out of bed. <laughs> but that, she'll have to work that out herself. But she managed this morning. She got her job done this morning. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she took you to the vet. Before or after she threw up. Well, she didn't take you to the vet. She took the dog to the vet with you. Yes. Yes. That was a funny vet. Oh, Banjo. Who? Banjo. Banjo. Right, okay, Easter is Sunday. It's been determined. Banjo. Banjo. That's a good one. Yeah. Mm. That's one of the better ones so far. Oh. It is. That's a nice name. We haven't had a bad joke. Nope. No. No, she. No, Carlina's now given up in elephants. Mm. Totally given up in elephants, isn't that right? Yes. Excellent. And I'm hoping Janine's given up in emus. Oh yeah. <laughs> they were messy. Very messy. He does look a bit like a, a border collie Newfoundland mix. My grandparents had a lovely border collie called Tina. Oh, you could give the puppy naming or honour to the winner of the Henny Penny board if it gets sold out. Yeah. Oh, you could do that. <laughs> Wanda, Wanda, oh dear me. Roger Reed says she'll, she'll start with $200 for Wanda's brother. <laughs> Wanda, Wanda would be very disappointed, Roger. That would be, it would be enough to cast her into a deep depression. Poor Wanda. How much did the puppy weigh? Can you remember? Did, did they tell you? They didn't weigh him. Okay. Yeah, so he's had his vaccines today, which is good. Winston. That's actually a really nice name for him. I like that name. Ellis. Bandit. I had a bandit. Sparky. Sparky. Beethoven. Winston is hey, a nice get out name. Of there, ding -dong. Oh, what are you after now? Scouty. He is really lovely. Oh my gosh, I'm fiddling with this. Well, they must have weighed him at the vet. It will be on his documentation somewhere because they gave him injections. And I think you have I to do that. I had it on a piece of paper. We put it on a piece of paper. For $178, they should have. Been. <laughs> He's disappearing again. Where are you going? Little pesta. Is he about time for sleep? Huh? When does he go? Oh. I don't think he's ready for sleep. No, he doesn't look... You may be ready for him to sleep. Yeah. Well, I hope, <laughs> you're, a different one. Well, I hope you're going to be awake for a while then. <coughs> yeah. Wanda does not want to play. Wanda, you want to come up? Come on, darling. I'll save you. I'll save you. Oh, you're such a good girl. Don't bite her tail. No, no, no. He is very fond of Wanda. No. Wanda is not a fan no. of him. There you go. He's a good girl, Wanda. No biting. Yes. You're very brave. Very brave. So tomorrow is actually Thursday. Right. It is. All day. Do you know, or what are you doing tomorrow? Don't do that. Don't, everybody's going to give me hell for that now. I told him not to chew on her leg. To break it. Oh, have you got a job tomorrow? I don't know. Soon. It's not tomorrow yet. No. I can't read that. Anyway, tomorrow will be what tomorrow brings to us. That's and, right. Um, we'll figure it out when we get there. We will. We will. I just had to correct him because he was going to get her, was he gonna nip her, her leg. Her? It's not very big. It could be broken by a clown like this. We don't need that. You've got to stop that. Jumping okay. and biting. 
Yes. It's a terrible, terrible thing for them to do. Their teeth or something. Are like needles. Yes. When do their puppy teeth come out? When they knock them out. Just when they knock them I out? Know. I don't know either. I don't know. I never paid any attention to that whole process. Yeah. Okay. So. He's not jumping and biting now. No, he's not. Still wagging his tail, though. That's good. Okay, Doc. So, we will be back tomorrow. Uh, 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 don't do that. No. Don't do it. That's a good boy. What a good mm. boy. There we go. What a nice puppy. He is. He will be a good puppy. Okie dokie. So we'll be back tomorrow. And, Don't um, bite me either. I'm not biteable. Once we work out what we're doing. So, pleasant evening. Pleasant evening. Pleasant evening. <laughs>